and April 27, 2011, we were destroyed by the tornado that come through Coleman. We were totally destroyed, leveled, and we've rebuilt, and business has been fantastic. Coleman has supported me big time, and even people from out of town have come just to check us out. I'm Kitty Spears and I am the owner of the Busy Bee Cafe and we have been in Coleman since 1919. Two fries, one well done, two single hamburgers, one's well done. We serve a old-fashioned breaded hamburger. It's, uh, it's our bread and butter. It's our number one seller. Love the Busy Bee. Been coming here for years. What makes it so good? The hamburgers. <laughs> <laughs> hamburgers are the best. 610. About every day and every morning. Twice. At least twice a day, once a day for sure. You can't beat the service, and that's what I go for. My wife wouldn't come down here till uh, about a month ago. Never had been in this place. And I finally talked her into it. I told her I was going to leave if she didn't come. First year to participate in the Coleman Oktoberfest. It was such a big, huge success last year that we wanted to be a part of it this year. And since we started serving dinner on the weekends, we wanted to serve a authentic German meal. We have a red cabbage, a Jaeger schnitzel. It is a pork fry, a pan fried pork cutlet. Jaeger schnitzel. <laughs> Jaeger schnitzel. <laughs> I can't pronounce it, but I can eat it. Uh, people call me the Burger Meister. That's probably because I cook about a thousand burgers a day. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just doing home place. A lot of they probably have customers that come in here every day of the week. You know, so yeah, we see a lot that we know that come in here. It's basically, I'd say it's just a place to call home. It's clean, nice people, good food. Why go anywhere else? We're Coleman's Otis restaurant. See, right now we're the Otis new restaurant in town, so we're just real excited. We are bigger, better, and eager to serve you.